Hello everybody, Miss Trot again, um, and I am here with a graphic novel, that's right, graphic novel book recommendation. So, if you have never read the Nathaniel Hale's Hazardous Tales, I'm going to tell you right now, you have got to try one of these. These books are just absolutely amazing. They take some really important parts of history, and they make them fun and accessible, and the pictures are great. It's great illustrations. So, this book was set in World War I, um, which was a very much a trench war. It was very little actual open fighting. It was a lot of fighting in the trenches and just trying to get um, foot by foot. That's, that's literally how they measured success was they moved forward a couple of feet or a couple of yards. Um, if they could get you know, multiple yards, it was a great day. Um, and so it tells the, the true story of what it was like in these trenches. Um, I'm going to see if I can get a sample for you guys so you can see some of the pictures. And the thing I love about this author is he tells the story that's not as popular. So he doesn't tell the ones you've probably heard before. He makes sure to tell stories, the part of the story you haven't heard. So you can see the map here of where the war was fought. Um, I love this. Treaties, Trenches, Mud and Blood. Sounds cheerful. Just kind of gives you an idea of what this book is going to be like. And here's the first page. Um, so you can see great graphics, great art, um, and and a lot of humor in something that's really serious. I have read all of the books that I can get in his series. I've actually got to meet him before, and he's amazing, the author. Um, highly, highly recommend. And then if you look down here, you can also see we have some of his other books. There's one about the Underground Railroad. Um, the underground abductor and then we have some of the other books in here as well so if you were to search for nathaniel hale you'd find some of his other books check it out and then um let me know what you think either send me an email or leave a comment on our website or go ahead and go on our instagram and um, leave a comment about what you think about it our our our, in, our irving instagram is at irving's library i look forward to hearing what you guys think have fun and enjoy